Ladies and gents, it's Wednesday, and you're watching The Biggest Beauty Project. My house shouldn't be so, this week's topic is Caitlin's, and she wanted us to talk about what our biggest fear is and what our biggest dream is. And I have found that my fears don't change, but my dreams do. So, this may be different from what I've said in the past, and that's okay. Because people have a right to change their dreams if they want to. Um, yeah, so first things first. My biggest fear, and always has been, is height slash falling. Um, I really, really cannot stand getting on a ladder. Um, even if it's a little two-step ladder and I'm just getting something that's like two feet taller than me. Um, I think this is mainly because of my weight. I have a fear that the stepladder is going to break underneath me or a ladder won't support me or, you know, the steps going up to an attic aren't going to support me. I don't know. I don't know if that's the main reason or not. But I, after I get up two steps, I get very shaky and uh, I just don't like it. <laughs> um, so when I went to Chicago, when we all went to Chicago and went to go visit Amy, it was, it was kind of terrifying being at the top of the, um, Willis Tower, Sears Tower, whatever you want to call it. Um, yeah, being that high in the air and thinking that the ground is going to drop out from underneath me. Um, yeah, I know this is probably supposed to be a deeper question. Like, you know, do you feel fail, fear failure or do you fear, you know, dying or something like that? But you know what? I've had enough failures in my life where I just don't really worry about it anymore. I just kind of see it as a new point to begin from. So once you fail, you pick yourself up, you drop yourself, you know, dust yourself off and you try it again. Um, who knows? Next time your efforts could be, could give you different results. You never know. So um, my biggest dream and this has definitely changed since the last time we've talked about dreams. Um, my biggest dream right now, since I've started this weight loss process, um, and since I've joined this channel, is I would kind of like to be a counselor. Um, maybe not a certified counselor for schools or, you know, for family. Maybe a family. I don't know. I But I do want to go back to school and get some sort of degree in um, counseling psychology, whatever it needs to be, mainly because I want to help people who are also on a weight loss journey have so that they can have someone to talk to, um, teens and adolescents, so they can have someone to talk to when they have problems about their own body image. If there's a job out there that exists and you don't need a huge degree for it, please let me know and I'm going to apply for it right away because this is definitely something that I would like to do because going through all of this as I was growing up and dealing with, you know, not being normal by what society sees as normal and not being accepted by society. I'd like to help those who feel that they're in that place and that they need help. Um, so that's definitely my new dream for the year. Um, who knows? Give me two months. It might change, but, um, Right now, that's that's kind of what I'm thinking about, and I hope that I can become an advocate for other people down the road. So, yeah, those are my fears and my dreams. So, yeah, um, things are going good in my personal life. I hope everything is going good with the girls. Um, I miss you all. I really, really do. I miss talking with you guys. We need to get together and have a chat sometime soon because yeah maybe I'll set that up um I can't wait until May um I wish May was tomorrow to be honest um <laughs> because I want to go and see all of you all all of you all really I want to see all y'all I'll say it like a Texan um and I want to see y'all soon I want to see y'all sooner than May but it's a good reason why we're going in May because of Caitlin's graduation. And girl, I am so proud of you. I am so happy that you're about to graduate and you're almost done with your journey. 
in college. Um, so yeah, I will see you all next week, next Wednesday. I hope you all have a great week, um, viewers and girls alike. And yeah, that's it. Oh, and Samantha, I loved your video this week. I watched it this week before I did mine. Um, and I think your dream is a great dream. And I really hope you and David stop start popping out some kids soon because I want to be an honorary aunt. Um, I know that that kid is going to have lots of aunts anyway, but I get to be an honorary one. I'm just saying. Um, yeah, <laughs> I hope you all have a great week and I will talk to you next Wednesday.